So we are here on the Open Tuesday stall, and uh, who, are, who are you? I'm Douglas De Mayo. Uh, and I'm Antonio Arce. And what are you showing on the Sousa stall today? So basically, uh, with, the, with the Sousa booth here, uh, we brought a various collection of our projects. Um, we, we have uh, the OBS open build service. Someone made that, uh, and so we thought it'd be pretty cool to just support you know that creativity and made 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 a uh, made a sticker to go along with it. Um, we also have tumbleweed, which is our rolling release, and um, that's been successful, very successful, in uh, moving forward with the newest packages. And opposite of that, uh, we have leap. So leap is more of a made for endurance, you could say. Um, it, it's more of a a well-established, uh, long-term, I'm not going to say support, but, but, it, but it, it's, it's more older packages, you know, that people uh, that don't want the newest stuff will do that. Well, it is long-term support because, uh, Antonio, you made a comment during your, your keynote this morning about how you've worked successfully with Plasma. Can you tell us about that? Yes, uh, for LIT, we are using the LTS support of Plasma, and that includes all of the, the latest LTS support, the latest LTS packages. And then in Tumbleweed, we have the latest packages uh, practically released the, the same day or maybe the next day after they are released by upstream. And then in Package Hub, we also have uh, packages from the community which are released for the uh, enterprise version of Sleep. And then we also have the uh, LTS version of Plasma here in, on Kelly packages here on, on Package Hub. And uh, another great project that's come from OpenSUSE is OpenQA. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, well, I'll, I'll go ahead and touch on it briefly. OpenQA uh, was, was a project established during uh, our hack week, and so basically people can benefit of working at SUSE and, and being part of the Open SUSE project, is that you'll get paid for a week to do whatever you want to do. So uh, that was developed, and uh, OpenQA is an automated testing system, and it's being used by OpenSUSE and Fedora, as well as many other um, projects that are around, and it's, it's, very, it's very beneficial to, to testing and, and testing a lot of different things and collaborating with different communities on, on tests. You want to expand on that a little? No, I mean, we can maybe add that uh, we are testing all the packages every day and everything that gets into Tumbleweed, is, which is a rolling release, so we have the latest packages of every uh, application there. Uh, it's tested before it's released for, uh, for users, so uh, even if it's rolling release, it's quite stable thanks to OpenQA. And I know from uh, working with the Plasma team that there are people from SUSE who come into the Plasma channels who say, hang on, this isn't working today, and we've got crack Plasma developers who go, good, good catch, we'll go, get on and fix that, so that, that works really well. Uh, you gave the keynote this morning, Antonio. What did you talk about? I talked about the KDE community and the KDE communities around us and uh, the ecosystem uh, that we have and how we should uh, collaborate together even more than we are doing right now, which I think is already quite, quite uh, good. But uh, yeah, I think we have to collaborate more uh, between us. Well, thank you very much for coming on. Thank you question. Go ahead. Uh, this question is for uh, Douglas. I know that uh, SUSE uh, actually installs by default GNOME. What do we have to do in the KDE community to change that? Well, uh, I think keep doing what you're doing right now, is, and it will lead to, to greater, greater achievement. I mean, things like this take time, right? And I think Package Hub is a good start for that. Um, but, but all I can really say from that perspective is, keep going down the path that they're going down, which seems to be very, um, I mean, very positive. I think positive all across. Okay, thanks. So thank you for coming, and thank you for your support for KDE. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>